Hello everybody and welcome back to Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic. Today we encounter a couple different bots. One of them is a little more heart-wrenching than the other and then we find a Romeo and Juliet-esque thing going on at some point towards the end. So uh, buckle up, there's a lot going on and uh, the actual video will start in a moment. I kind of want to... where is it? Okay, here we go. If this was, uh, by far the worst quest... Oh, can I not? Oh, I can. I can go across the bridge. Okay, that was a little... It was cool, though. I did like it. I, I liked it. I, like, it made you kind of, um... It definitely made you think outside the box. Wow, that was fast. What are those out there? Holy cow! Down you go! Oh, I need to level up. Need to level up, Candrus. Oh, we're looking. We're looking. We're looking. We're looking for the sex robot. Don't worry about it. I'm <laughs> what? What? Level up. Um, strength. Nice. Um, skills. Um. Should I? Should I try putting points into other things for Candorous, like demolition? Instead of treat injury. Oh, is strength only good for melee weapons? I dang it, I didn't realize that actually. Thank you. Oh, that makes sense. Dexterity is ranged weapons. Shoot. Oh well. You're right. You're verily right. I'm just gonna put a point into demolitions because I can. I don't. I don't know what to do with that. Let's see. Adds a plus 10 to the damage of the next blaster, but and minus 3 to hit. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Quadruples the critical threat range of ranged attacks. Attack hits, targets also stunned. Perfect. Let's do it. Um, at, can I go? Oh, I can. Oh, I thought it was like done, done, done. Wow. Why? Why was he? Why was he built like? Why was he specced for strength then? If he's supposed to be a blaster person. Dumb. Well, I guess I guess I could make him melee, but he's got a Mandalorian like heavy weapon. Hmm, this one. Except. What? Still. Oh, okay, now I get to move. Alright, let's go destroy these guys. I need me some XP! Let's go! Not that I'm getting a lot of XP, but it is what it is. Cute. More of you. You guys just keep spawning in. Horny cat hound. No, no, no. None of that now. None of that now, young man. <laughs> I lost over 800 XP with that quest. It happens. Actually, what? Yeah. And then what? I'm gonna move. That'll show you.
Anything you guys dropped. Mandalorian data pad. A backpack. Oh ho, yum yum. Remains. Mandalorian data pad, melee shield. Oh, I need to do that. Eradu strength amplifier. Yeah, my force power usage is affected by me being light or dark side. Um, well, I have m my, my big abilities. I use the force lightning a lot. But, um... I'm, I'm generally light side. But the dark side powers are way cooler. Oh, okay. Oops. Romance is happening happening at steady intervals. Wow, we're just all over the place. Watch this. Oh. I'm gonna die. <laughs> worried it's fine oh whoa what is going on over there ah. oh it's the sex droid we found the sex droid When you find someone you're interested in, yeah, it takes you to Tango, assuming they're interested in you back. Hello, Sextroid. Thank you for saving me, Master Jedi. I am C842, a personal assistant droid. When you are drunk, romance briefly happens. You fall in love. Um, why, what person, why were the cat hounds attacking you? Who knows? They are beasts and have been very aggressive of late. I'm sorry if I seem a bit abrupt, but I must be moving along. I am rather in a hurry. Are you running from something? From my master. <gasps> Wait, did she send you to find me? Please do not tell her you saw me. <gasps> uh, you're running from her? Yes, but I have my reasons. I'm afraid my owner became a bit too attached to me. Obsessed, even. She, she tried to treat me as her dead husband. It was not healthy. Wow. All the time? You don't want to <laughs> Oh my gosh! This poor guy has been like sexually harassed! Oh my gosh! Run, little robot! I didn't realize robots could be sentient enough to like escape. Like, I thought they'd be like bound. But like, I don't know. I guess some of them have seem to have more more uh, leeway in their programming than others do. <laughs> How would that work with the droid you had? Hey man, it wouldn't be that difficult. Uh, probably not. She is obsessed. She rarely sees other people and appears to be fixated on me as her husband. She was becoming more and more insular. I thought it best that I leave. She may meet other real people this way. In fact, that was the reason I came here and sought out those cat hounds. Oh, what? You sought them out. I think it would be best if I were no longer a factor. She would meet new people. Living people, please. But like, destroy no! Them. He's alive in his own way. Like, what? Uh. I'll destroy you and tell her why you did it. No. What? Oh. A 
destroy you and tell her you're still out there? What? Why can't I just let him go? Why can't I just let him go do his own thing? I don't like this one. Like, I want him to live his own life. What the heck? I don't want... I'm not gonna send him back to a woman who's sexually harassing. Because you gotta make the tough decision! Okay, I'll destroy you and tell her why you did it. I'll destroy you and tell her you're still out there. But then she'll just keep looking. But if I tell her that you were destroyed and why you did it, she probably won't appreciate that, you know? I feel like a, a, a Jedi would keep him alive and let, make him go back, but I don't like that. Oh. Kill her and tell- that's the only- that's the only thing I can think is that I'll destroy you and tell her why you did it. Yeah, she needs to know she's a loon, if nothing else, for his sake. Thank you, Kaisa. You have my- I'm a woman! <sighs> No. No. I've had to do terrible things these this day. What has happened? Where are they? Why did Karth all the What's going on? Candorus is dying and Karth died. Where are they? What? What? What's going on? <laughs> oh my god. What's going on? <laughs> How do you just die? I I don't understand. I can't I can't go anywhere until I bring my party back. No, I can't. No! What's going on? I can't travel anywhere! Where did they go? Why? Where did they go? They were right behind- I can't fast travel! I can't! Look! Were you guys- What? Did they? What? Sympathy death pouring one out for the robo homie, I guess. Come, please move. And oh, now I can't move. Look at this. This thing died with its tongue out. I was like. Wah. Okay, they're way over there. But I can't move. I'm, I, I know you guys might not be able to hear me, but I'm hitting the desk as hard as I can. Like, I'm hitting the keys as hard as I can. And I can't go anywhere. Save again. Why me? Good night, Tobias. I still can't move. Oh, uh, here, let's, I guess, yeah, we'll do the, the reload thing. Uh, boop, boop, load. There we go. Time to go rescue my stupid friends. Oh, boy. 
way. This is gonna suck. Oh crap. No, I didn't, I couldn't, oh dang it. Okay, it's okay though. I couldn't, I didn't heal fast enough. I had too many other commands in the way. Yes, yes, Tobias, goodbye, my mortal enemy. I shall see you on tomorrow or, or whenever we shall meet again. I look forward to it. No. <laughs> Oh my gosh, please! Okay. kill I just I just need to like like take a health pack every five seconds and not use lightning and just use my stuff for healing I'm trying to attack the smaller ones and I can't. Try throwing this sticky grenade. Frograt, I just watched Hateful Eight. What a movie. Do I, I, do I still have the... Like, if I had one other companion with me, this would be so much easier. But yeah, if I still have a sticky grenade. I'll just lure this one over really quick. that one and then I'll throw the sticky grenade if it'll let me move oh my gosh it's not okay I don't actually have sticky grenades I only have ion grenades I guess I can throw that but I don't think it does anything really oh it does oh <laughs> This one, this one, oh. this one, this one. This one! Oh. Ah, go, 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 go! Yes! Yes! Please, please, please let me move. Oh. Please. Please! This is so annoying! <sighs> Go into settings and check the V-Sync? Where is that? Oh shoot, it looks like I could actually uh, change it from that to like one of these, maybe. I, I would be I would be worried about doing that now. Well, where's the V sync? Okay, now I can move. Dang it. <laughs> <laughs> Whew, okay. 
Okay, yes, freaking great. You idiots, you absolute idiots. Thank you, thank you. Overlord, freaking heck, that's been really annoying. Like half my saves are from getting stuck. You imbeciles, why would you do that? Now we have to fast travel. I love this thing though, like just transiting back and forth. Lots of saves to be had. It's fine, I'll do it myself. <laughs> oh, perfect, this is great. All right, I did see Mandalorians over here. Hiya! In we go. Yes, end of the cave. Thank you. Just no, I clicked on this guy. Why? Okay, that's fine. I guess. Down you go. Oh, you think the best me in the blade? I am a Jedi! Ha ha ha! You cannot best me in the blade. It's a Doros! The the, the grey-headed aliens are Doroses. Well, I'm getting lots of stuff from these guys, which is nice. Footlocker, average plasma mine, flash mine, wow. Frag mine, stuff I can sell. Ooh, okay, cool beans. I think I got those. Did I get those? Yeah. Did I pick up this? I'm getting all these Mandalorian data thingies. The best raw damage dealers are Juhani and Zalbar, if you ever have a super tough fight. Okay, I brought, um, Candorous in for tough fights, and that seems to work, usually. Um, but yeah. I wasn't sure if Zalbar was. I didn't realize Juhani was. I need to bring her out more. What's this? Is this a farm? What the heck? Uh, oh, this is one of those big farms, right? This is private property. By what authority are you trespassing on this estate? I come on behalf of the Jedi Council. The Council? If you are here because of Shen Makali's disappearance, you are wasting your time. The Sangos are not involved. This is nothing but a Makali witch hunt. I'm not in league with the Metallis, but I must speak to Nurik. Nurik left orders he was not to be disturbed, but given the circumstances, I will make an exception. Go into the main hall. Nurik will meet with you there. Well, gee willikers, thanks, man. That was really accommodating of you. You're the worst protection droid ever. Because there's something, there's a quest in here, around here somewhere, about um, these two families... These two major families who are like one of their like heirs is missing and they think it's like Somebody's the other family's fault Whew, I kind of want to go in this side door Nah Nah, yeah, you know, yeah, it didn't go in it didn't do it Dang it. I gotta go in the front door I like these squat little trees. In we go! I have been informed by my protocol droid that you wish to speak to me. Dave. Um, I'm here on behalf of the Jedi Council. I am investigating the disappearance of Shamatale. I brought my family here to find peace and safety. 
not to be harassed and treated like common criminals? Your council has no authority here, and I respectfully ask you to leave this property at once. This guy isn't telling us Ooh. something. He might even be lying. I don't trust him. I trust you will show yourself I out. trust. If not, my security droids will be sure to deal with you. That's suspicious, my dude. I know, right? It you definitely seems like a star-crossed lovers. Looking for Shen Metale? Oh, okay, hello. Uh, do you know something about Shen's disappearance? My name is Rahasia. Nourish She's is my pretty! He has not been himself since Cassus disappeared. He is mad with grief, and he is convinced the Metales are responsible. He's not thinking rationally. Uh, does, have, does this have anything? Cassie has disappeared? Yes. Cassis was my brother. He was working on archaeological <gasps> digs here in Dantan Whoa! when he disappeared. My father blamed Alan Matale. I love him! Son. My father is a good man. When my mother died, he raised me and my brother by himself. He loves his children, and we love him. I just don't want you to judge him too harshly. Um, what has your father done? You must understand that father has been under a terrible strain. I have no wish to disobey him, but there are matters where even my father's authority is not absolute. Uh, please tell me what's happened. My father has kidnapped. Yep, the okay. He is holding him prisoner here in the compound. That was easy. He feels this is a way to get back at the Metales, a way to get even for the disappearance of my brother Cassus. Since Cassus went missing, my father has become unstable. He no longer even cares if the Metales are responsible for what happened to Cassus. I am afraid my father will simply kill Shen out of a mad, misguided lust for vengeance. Why are you telling me all this? Shen is an innocent victim in all this. My father is not a bad man, but his grief has driven him to madness. He must be stopped. Please, find Shen and rescue him before my father does something he will regret forever. I would take you to the prison, but I cannot let my father see me with you. Take this key. It will wow. open an unguarded door at the rear of the estate. You and Shen can make your escape through there. There are many security droids guarding the halls. Please hurry. You are Shen's only hope. <gasps> I'm his only hope! What's the problem between your families? Alan Matale and my father have had problems ever since they settled on this world. To hear my father tell it, Alan is a brute and a bully, but a rich one. He feels his credits give him the right to step all over normal people. My father stands up to Alan because no one else will. But now he thinks Alan has taken my brother Cassus and has imprisoned Shen as revenge. Please find Shen and free him. You are my only hope. Only hope for what? He may murder an innocent kid, but he's not a bad man. I mean, you know, he had his reasons, I guess. Well, this is this has gone. This 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 kind of blew up in our faces. So I do actually have to go. Uh, it's about 4:30 my time. And I have, or no, maybe not D. No, I do have D and D tonight. Shoot, I think, yes, I have another one tonight. But, um, thank you so much for joining me. I appreciate it. <laughs> we'll get back to this uh, Romeo and Juliet thing probably tomorrow a little bit after some Undertale. Why do they sway like that? Because they're in the game. Because they're trying to look realistic with limited polygons. But, yeah, I think I'll head out. I'll get ready. I'm gonna maybe go pass out for a bit. Another long night. <laughs> None of you guys plays D&D &D and it shows. <laughs> but yeah, no, thank you guys for coming by. I appreciate it. Thank you so much. And and I will be streaming tomorrow. And, and I'll see you later.